I cannot, I just cannot get my head out of the speculations that are going on right now. You know, judging from, you know, from the mid-season finale, from the, you know, how it ended. I mean, it was very, I dare say that th that mid-season finale was very predictable. Um, you know, it's like they threw hints at us in the promo that they were going to put Felicity in grave danger. Not just, not by putting her in that, um, in that cell with, you know, with little air, but, you know, having her gunned down in cold blood. I mean, that was just, they were just, they were throwing hints at us that she was going to be in danger. Now, if they didn't show her in danger, like, <gasps> in the cell, um, and then just show everyone else being in danger, then okay. Then I probably would have been slightly, that would have chipped down the, you know, from, chipped down, you know, the episode from being predictable. You know what I mean? But, um, I mean, I, I just can't, I just can't help but wonder, did it, I mean, does the CW, do you, like, do you think they have the guts do you think they have it within him, within them, to, to kill off this character? One side of me is saying yes, you know that's exactly what they're gonna do, and the other side is saying no, they're gonna, they're gonna bring her back somehow. I mean, there's, you know, there's, you know, the Flash, you know, you got people with superpowers, and you got the, um, the Lazarus Pit. But I mean, I don't think Oliver would dare put her in that. I think she would. I think she would be pissed at him for putting her, you know, th through that, you know, seeing how his sister go, you know, is going through with that. I mean, I don't think he would dare do that. And, um, and blood was coming out of her mouth, so that, that's like, that means she's in, she's dangerously close to the red zone, and I mean, um, that's that's one that's one thing that they they taught that me and some friends and some people other people were talking about on The Walking Dead when people thought Glenn was killed and then he was being ripped apart by you know by walkers. Um, you notice that blood and he, he wasn't spitting blood out of his mouth. But here, Felicity, when she was shot down, there was blood coming out. You know, there was she was bleeding from her mouth. You know, like. Like, you know, what was coming out, like, and, yeah, that, that, um, that's like, I mean, that's, that would be known as a queer sign that she is gone, or going to be gone, but, I don't know. Now, would I be mad if they, if they did kill her off? Um... I want to say I would I, I would be a little hurt you know I would be I uh, know it would be you know a sad thing you know to, to lose a likable character but I would recover from that pretty quickly especially in, in, when it comes to a love interest for for Oliver um, I mean at first when you know when it when it showed you know a, when they started to show attraction for one, a mutual attraction for one another, um, I was like, oh, okay, all right, you know, come on. I mean, don't knock, you know, you know, she's an attractive, you know, girl, so, you know, give it a shot. But um, after a while, when it started to lean more towards a serious, you know, a serious relationship, and when it got really, really, really serious, like ride or die serious, I was like, I don't see it. I don't see it. I mean, I see that I see them being attracted to one another, but I do not see them settling down together. I just don't see it. I mean, I'm not. I mean, I'm not a, a Oliver Felicity hater, but I'm not. I most certainly am not a shipper either. It's like, for me personally, their relationship to me, like them being serious, you know, to where they'll be married and have kids and all that stuff together. I mean, I don't know. It just, it's just, it, it seems, it's, it's just like putting a slice of pizza, dipping a slice of pizza 
and peanut butter. I mean, it just it just seems off to me. I mean, like the whole serious, the real serious aspect of the relationship. But um, I just, you know, I I would, I'm just, I just think I I feel that you know Oliver and Sarah were a much 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 better couple, and when they decide when they made the when they made that break and when they broke up i was i was pissed i was pissed like what the fuck i mean like you know they're great together i mean like they're like batman and wonder woman in the way in in some weird way you know like where they're nearly the same and you know and they're and it and they have a lot in common and and they're just I mean, that just feel. I mean, it just feels right. I mean, like you know, this for those two to be together, and I dare say that when, when um, Sarah was killed off, you know, this this is before she was brought back, but when she was killed off, I was like, what the fuck? They just killed her off like she was nothing. I mean, that is fucking fucking bullshit. But um, this wouldn't be the first time the CW slash WB um hints at us that they're gonna kill off a certain character and then you see for yourself that they are really gonna kill them that yeah they really did kill them off but there's there's also that other possibility that while Felicity is fighting for her life or whatnot it could be someone else that gets killed off like we've been seeing her mother quite a bit lately so it could be her that gets killed off it could be Lance that gets killed off it could be Thea you know, it could be anyone. It, 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 it may not be Felicity, but I think that would be a little bit of a cop out if she did survive this. Because I mean, it looked like it looked like there was no no way for her to come back. I mean, I, I don't know exactly where she was shot at, but for her for blood to come out of her mouth, I mean, it, it's severe. I mean, it's very severe. <laughs> I read an in interesting article that um that Felicity could be, in, could be, could cheat death and become Oracle. Um, for those of you who don't know that, um, Oracle is, what was Batgirl was um, Barbara Gordon is Oracle and she was nearly, nearly killed in action as Batgirl and um, she, she was paralyzed from, you know, from the waist down. She could never, she can't use her legs again. So, um, so she becomes like you know the eyes and ears for um for the you know i guess for for Batman's daughter and you know in that TV series Birds of Prey before they for before they canceled it um so they're saying no so there's a theory that you know she may do that you know but i um i don't think that's going to happen no i don't think that's going to happen um but then again, I mean, I am not knocking that possibility that um, they're th you know they're using Felicity as a curveball to throw us off to who like who um, who actually dies you know this season. So um, who do you think? I mean, who do you think it is? Do you think Felicity is truly dead, or do you think she you know, or do you think she will um, that you? You or you think she'll survive, and they, and they don't have the balls to kill her off. And um, if you don't think it's Felicity, then who do you think is in that grave? Let me know in the comment section. And if um, well, if you enjoyed, you know, my little um breakdown of, you know, on um the whole conspiracy of um Felicity's uh, potential death, um, be sure to thumb up the video. And if you're new to the channel, be sure you click subscribe. And um, I will see you in the next video. Peace out, guys. <laughs>